Let's talk about some charity. I like that. All right, okay. since, launch, since launching in 2009, Soren Kaba Jones's charity, Face Africa, has raised more than $250,000 for clean water projects in Liberia. Wow, and on Saturday, Face Africa will host its annual gala, and it's sure to be a night to remember. Sure is. So, Ron, welcome to Arise 360. Thank you. Hi, how Hi. are you? Oh, I'm okay. good, thank you. You've raised a quarter of a million dollars since yes. 2009. Wow. You've helped thousands of Liberians get clean water. What made you decide to focus on Liberia and what made you decide to launch this charity? Well, first of all, thanks for having me. I'm oh, so excited no. to be here. Girl, you know how I'm I feel about you. I'm a huge fan of the Yay! show. <laughs> well, I'm from Liberia originally. Um, my family and I fled the country when I was eight years old as a result of the Civil War. And I went back 20 years later and saw that there was a desperate need for basic social services like access to clean water, health care, education. And um, I decided to make clean water my area of focus because it's one of the largest health issues uh, facing the world today. Nearly a billion people worldwide don't have access to safe drinking water. A billion, you a, said? Nearly a billion. My goodness. And most of them are in Africa. On the continent alone, 350 million people don't have access to this basic necessity. Wow. So it's a huge problem all across the board. Now, how are you all doing this? Do you ship water to them or do you give filters to them to clean the water they have? So essentially, we purify the water that's mm. already there okay. and um, build wells and boreholes um, and make the water safe for them to drink. Wow. Now, are you only focused on Liberia or does this extend to other countries on the continent? For now, just Liberia, because okay. we're quite um, a small nonprofit, but we're growing and as we continue to grow, we do plan to go to other countries in Sub-Saharan Africa. Um, we're mainly looking at countries like Sierra Leone, Ghana, and even Nigeria. Um, Senegal. So we want to cover all of Africa. Mm -hmm. Now well, you said you're small, but how have you grown over the years? Well, um, I'll say thanks to social media. Mm -hmm. Surprisingly, we've been um, very fortunate to get a, a large support base uh, through our social media and outreach efforts. So people have been very responsive to the need and the cause and have just been so supportive and, and helping us to grow over the years. Now, is it true that in Liberia, women are mainly responsible for the collection of the water? And so does that make this more of not only a water issue but a health issue. Absolutely, and a gender, a gender issue as well. Gender, right. mm -hmm. And it's not just in Liberia, but all around the world. Um, apparently, 40 billion hours annually are lost um, as a result of of walking to fetch water. And a lot of young girls wow. can't even go to school, go to school because exactly. they're responsible for fetching the water for the household. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So the water issue is a women's issue. So once you solve the water crisis, you not only solve health, but you also allow girls to go to school. You allow women to, pr to focus more on productive act activities like going to market um, and selling and farming and things like that. What's the reaction been from the people that you've helped in Liberia? Oh, absolutely incredible. Yeah. Um, that's, that's the best part of the job. That's the best part of what we do, just seeing the faces on the, the men, women, and children who benefit from our water projects. It's absolutely priceless. Aww. Well, we want to help out. How can others yeah. out there that want to go to the gala buy tickets? And if absolutely. they're unable to go, how else can they contribute? Well, tomorrow is World Water Day, and all across the world, people are coming together to raise awareness for the water crisis. And we're doing so through our gala that we're hosting here in New York City at Chelsea Piers. Tickets are still available on online okay. at faceafrica.org. Okay. Um, we're expecting about 300 people. We have a, a it, it's usually a really good time, so it's a great way for people to come and, and meet um, really amazing change makers and, and young leaders, but also to support a great cause. Okay. That's great, and what's the website? www.faceafrica.org. And this is on Saturday night, right? Tomorrow night. Tomorrow night. All right. Okay, I'll see you there. All right. See I've you. got a gown. <laughs> uh -oh, <laughs> Thank party you so to much. remember. <laughs> party Thank for a so cause. Like Thank you that. so much, and I'll see you tomorrow. All right, see All right. you. Thanks Take for having care. me. All right. And you're watching Arise Entertainment 360.